So the bull camp might feel like it's back in control right now after the market has once again been very well supported in 2018 on a dip below 6,000. We've since seen a healthy recovery out from those recent lows below 6,000 with the market averting a break to a fresh 2018 low back below the June low and rallying back up towards the 7,000 area. And so it looks like we could see additional upside over the coming sessions, but it would be foolish for the bull camp to be thinking that things are going to be rocketing higher from here at this stage. When you look at this weekly chart, it's overwhelmingly bearish. Going back to that record high in 2017, since then the market has been in breakdown mode with a series of lower tops along the way and a very prominent contraction in range. That contraction in range has taken us down towards this very tight zone here with the market at this point on the verge of an imminent breakout given where we're at in the scope of this triangle. Now, considering a breakout that's imminent and the trend that we've seen, that breakout is expected to be to the downside with the market continuing and breaking down below 6,000, but this time for a significant breakdown that takes us back towards the September 2017 low, that next major support at 2975. If the market wants to avoid this breakdown, it's going to need to push into this recovery back above that current lower top around 8,500 to have any success. Until then, rallies should be very well capped and the downtrend remains firmly intact.